the Division III Region 11 quarterfinals were drawn and set for a testing matchup in Jackson between the Boom Carroll Bulldogs and the Jackson Ironmen. Even before going into this contest, you just had that feeling it was going to be a special night of football. And that it was. Starting off towards the end of the fourth quarter, Jackson's quarterback Buddy Wolford keeps it himself on the lead option and waltzes his way into the end zone for the first points of the matchup. Bloom Carroll and their defense were ready to make a big stand. On the next Ironman possession, Dylan Armand Trout pounces on the loose football and it's Bulldog ball close to enemy territory. The Bulldogs could not get anything going on that possession where the both defenses were just playing a fantastic game all around. About five minutes left in the second quarter, the Bloom Carroll go for it on fourth down. Then Ken Vong takes a lick as he barely gets the ball off and finds Jet Jones, but he's called just short as they bring out the chance for the final decision. With just about 39 seconds left in the first half, the Bulldogs were finally able to crack through on the scoreboard. Then Ken Vong drops back in, finding wide open Carter Cornelius in the middle of the end zone to tie the game up at 7 going into the halftime break. Midway through the third, and Jackson are able to retake the lead. Chris Evan eat the crap to 44 yard go ahead field goal. 10-7 Ironman. This score will now hold going into the fourth quarter. Lots of defensive and big plays on both sides of the football. We see this game remain 10-7, going into the last few minutes of the contest. That's when we saw Bloom Carroll do what they've done all season. Quick, smart football, driving themselves down the field. But the Jackson defense had other ideas. They stopped them in the red zone. Now with only under two minutes left and a fourth and seven coming up for the Bulldogs. Ethan Tantanavong drops back. He looks to get sacked, but no, he gets the football off and he finds Kirk Cornelius as he takes the ball in stride and into the promised land. Blue Curl now up 14 to 10. The Bulldogs defense then stood their ground and stopped the Jackson defense to now advance to the regional semifinals against Bishop Watterson next week. Now these two squads are no two unfamiliar opponents. Bloom Carroll took down Bishop Watterson by a score of 33-26 in the regional final last year. For Grand Glory, I'm Gavin Carey.